My name is Sai Teja. I am studying 10th standard in Biram Chita Reddy International School. Today, we will discuss about conservation of forests and wildlife. First, why should we conserve them? Let us discuss. If we look into forests, forests are lungs of the earth. Why do we call forests as lungs of the earth? If we think about forests, we will remember about trees. Trees absorb carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and release oxygen into atmosphere. This oxygen can be used for breathing and later for respiration by our body. And forests maintain clouds and in turn the rainfall pattern, climate, stability and air quality. How can forest help for rainfall? Forest the trees present in forest absorb the water present in the soil and evaporate them in the process of transpiration. This is called as evapotranspiration. Now, why should we conserve forest? What are the uses of forest? Oxygen and rainfall. This we discussed above. Now, prevent soil erosion. Generally, trees have long roots for a long distance. Those Roots helps soil to hold tightly and prevent soil erosion and various medicines such as neem, mint, lemon. These are helpful for preparing medicines. Raw materials in industries. The main required material industries are raw materials. For example, wood, rubber like this. These raw materials can be obtained from the forest. That is why we have to conserve forest. Now, conservation of wildlife. Why should we conserve wildlife? Because they are part of ecosystem. Ecosystem means interaction between the organisms and physical environment. And some of the organisms please the environment such as scavengers. And they maintain ecological balance. And coming to the wildlife, some species are extinct. They are already disappeared, like dinosaur, and some are adding extinction. They are going to disappear. The examples are sparrows. And endangered species must be protect, protected. Which are going to extinct, they must be protected. And wildlife also have equal rights to stay on this planet. And the protected areas of wildlife can be called as wildlife sanctuaries, national parks and biospheres. And th that is why we should conserve wildlife. And these are the reasons why we should conserve forest and wildlife. Thank you.